Yo. 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 This is Lil' LA Stay Live. I am back again with another crystal mid jet charging video. Hey, I want to thank all y'all for tapping into this video. You can stay tuned. I'll be showing you the crystals that I have charging here. Uh, of course, when I do a mid jet crystal charging video, it's actually raining outside. This is how I charge my videos. I have my shades on. It's dark. But guess what? These, sh these shades are actually helping me see. So just bear with me. I'm not trying to hide my eyes or anything like that. My current glasses, they were broken. And so that they was broken, these are the only extra pair that I had as prescription kind of makes sense I had shades with prescriptions these are the shades and I had my clear vision well you know I could just see <clears throat> period so just bear with me with this video I want to thank y'all for tapping in it's all about these crystals charging these uh, crystals that I have I wanted to be able to uh, turn the camera around, but it seems as if my phone won't help me do that. So, uh, once again, bear with me. I'll let y'all see uh, the bucket of crystals that I have. Mainly rose quartz coming from uh, South Georgia. So, ah, uh, the smell of rain. Ah. Uh, Smells, smells pretty nice. I don't know if it's the uh, nachos I was just eating <laughs> or the rain itself. But guess what? One thing about the rain you want to pay attention to is that when it rains, it gives off negative ions. You can Google about neg negative ions. Negative ions helps you uh, with your respiratory system. So when it comes to breathing or whatnot, uh, the proper air that you need to survive negative ions is a part of that uh, system uh, that you need to breathe breathe and uh, intake and, and so on and so forth so I like to speak about ions because uh, it became very interesting when I found that ions are um, actually created during smudging so all you crystal lovers out there that um, <clears throat> are familiar with uh, how to charge crystals you know there are many ways but uh, yeah smudging is one for itself smudging um, with smoke creates this smoke right and once you get this smoke it kind of clears the um, air of all the toxic whether you know it or not it actually um, helps get rid of the toxics within the air and that's where you get um, the, the I would say uh, you can get some substance from smudging which is the smell that you may receive that's a good sign you know a good uh, thing when it comes to the smell uh, of any incense or maybe sage or whatever um, you know there's so much stuff that you can actually burn um, besides toxics okay you want to get incense you want to have oils to burn you want you know different fragrances um, possibly uh, sage and palacinto so uh, and there's more I'm pretty sure there's more out there uh, that you can uh, actually smudge with thank y'all for bearing with me uh, while you're in here go ahead and hit the like button share and subscribe I know I haven't been posting videos lately but this video is for you guys who have been waiting to watch me speak and uh, 
which is the time for me to actually uh, give back to you guys for the time that I've lost on YouTube. But I've gained so much outside of YouTube and um, I'm building everything up so that I can share with you guys what I have going on. Okay? So, right now, it's, it's a lot to bear with. It's a lot to talk about. But I want to take it slow by doing what I do here on this channel. So, just bear with me. And uh, we're going to get to the crystals as soon as possible. But let's talk about the ion so we can give a little education about the rain here. Okay? So, and how positive it is to actually be out here. So, like I was saying, I was smelling the rain earlier. And we was talking about smudging, which creates uh, negative ions that helps uh, one's um, respiratory system. Okay? So, thank you. Uh, yeah. So, you would think uh, positive ions would be positive, but it's not. Positive ions means that uh, certain atoms have um, attracted toxic uh, <clears throat> particles or to toxic uh, energy or toxic um, within the atmosphere and gravitated to that atom. Okay? Which means that it's positive because it's gaining. Uh, what it don't need now an atom itself or you would say breathing in atoms certain atoms um, and if I got that right correctly I'm speaking of ions breathing in ions is uh, itself by itself is what you need so why, that's the reason why negative ions is a good thing to inhale with your respiratory system because um, it's, it's pure. Okay, so when they tell you to uh, go out in nature and adapt to nature, get away from all the toxics within the city, uh, that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to get you to uh, be attracted and uh, and, and kind of receive nature's part of negative ions. <clears throat> this happens when it rains. This happens amongst trees, the mist that comes amongst trees. So they ask you to get out in nature. Okay. Uh, that's going into uh, where there's trees, uh, most likely, you know, and uh, getting away from uh, like traffic cars and the such yes um very very healthy for you um i believe you guys uh will one day understand that nature wants to help you if you haven't understood that already and kind of grounded yourself uh to allow nature to help you um, through your journey, uh, you can start by uh, understanding that um, it's certain certain things that happen when you tap into nature that can actually get you to where you're going because you're going to need it anyway. Breathing air. Uh, what else can I say? Um, it's a lot to do with breathing air, okay? So, what you want to do is also, like, speaking into the universe of letting your heart vibrate. You know, that's why they say your heart is bigger than your mouth. That's because your heart it vibrates and it understands before you speak what you speak, okay? Uh, your heart is your second brain. I, I think you guys know that if you don't, you will learn in, your, uh, in school or whatnot, or uh, learn from this channel that your heart is your second brain, man. 
So it's thinking. It's thinking before you speak. Okay? So that's something you want to pay attention to. Like, oh my God, you know, it's, it get deep, man. Nature, nature is so, so full of um, wonderful, amazing, uh, spectacular crystals. <laughs> And speaking of crystals, I want you guys to see what I have out here. Thank y'all for uh, staying tuned. Y'all can stay to the end of this video. I want to make it a good video for you guys, uh, whether you can barely see me or not. Just listen to my voice. Bear with me. And when I say bear with me, I mean, hey, uh, people make mistakes. When it comes to the video, the YouTube streets is, but I'm out here, and I'm going to give y'all all I got, so take a look at these crystals, and um, hopefully when I turn this phone around, y'all get a good glimpse, but right now, um, it doesn't give me an opportunity to uh, switch the camera around to the front front of the phone so just bear with me thank you we have rose quartz here um i mined these crystals probably like two or three weeks ago but never had a chance to get some good rain but now that i got it as you can see there's a bucket full of rose quartz There's plenty of rose quartz. I'm looking for pink ones like this right here. Very pink. Transparent and all. So many crystals in there. You know, um, like I was saying, there are so many crystals in there. So many uh, rose quartz at that. Um, I just wanted to be able to share that with you guys. Um, while I was down in LaGrange, Georgia, picking up um, as many uh, crystals as possible um, to kind of share with you guys. And um, hey, the vibration of crystals actually um, raises your vibration, okay? I want y'all to understand that as well. Um, Hopefully everything in nature vibrates, including crystals, and your heart vibrates. All of this stuff that vibrates, vibrates out into the universe. And where there's an action, there's a reaction. So while we are vibrating and speaking into the universe, what we speak out very well may just come back to us. Um, there are superpowers out in the universe. And that's a simple fact. The fact that when you vibrate, that same vibration can be reciprocated back to you. That is a power. A power that you need to understand that when you speak, um, that very well may come into existence within your realm or someone else. I think we will understand that, especially as you grow into your spirituality uh, and understand that you're not alone. I'm not alone with you guys. And hopefully you don't feel alone when you watch this video. Um, hey, I had a chance to show you guys the crystals that I'm actually out here charging. Um, the best thing about this video is going to be the fact that uh, you watch me breathe in ion. which is very well received. And I say that because you can be amongst any negative energy but that can make it hard for you to breathe. But in 
instead come out here and join the rain, charging my crystals and breathing. Some fantastic air. And I it, I had um I advise everyone who's watching to the end of this video to do the same. Hey, when it rains, do things that I do. And it's worth it. When you got a car, which is something that I purchased like right before I went to pick up all those crystals. I purchased your car and when it rains I step out and watch it if it needs it. Now it rained the other day but I didn't have enough rain to uh, actually charge my crystals but it wasn't too long ago like two days ago or even last night I, don't, I can't remember but it wasn't enough rain for me to charge my, my uh, crystals but I did wash my car. So what I do is, uh, what you all can do, take a rag, when, if you love your car that much, take a rag, and some, uh, I use this detergent, I, I, I need it to get some uh, car wax, or, or car uh, detergent, whatever they call it, but, I had a chance to, but I didn't, that's because I'm more satisfied with just having this detergent. This detergent, I got a large bottle of it. Why not use it? It's just all I need is a little soap. I did that. I washed my car. I went over around my car and that's how I wash my car. That's something you can do when it rains. Outside of uh, being a crystal lover. But when you're a crystal lover, take your crystal out into nature. Let it get back out into nature. Everybody knows that uh, out in nature, most crystals get wet due to the rain. Alright, so that's something you can do to charge your crystals. Because water has memory. Water sinks into the crystals and gives crystals a memory. So when you're speaking and you have a crystal near you, that crystal is vibrating. And when you speak, your voice is vibrating into that crystal. Now, the crystal is not going to stop vibrating. It's going to keep vibrating. But it will pick up on your voice. And when it picks up on your voice, it sends your voice out into the universe. That's just what happens. That's the most important thing about crystal is that it vibrates. You have something that vibrates that's near you. Not only that. Crystals come with different, different, many colors, and those colors tap in to different frequencies. And that's the amazing thing about crystals, that they tap into different frequencies. Okay, and uh, you want to activate uh, all of your chakras. And crystals, certain crystals activate certain chakras. Okay, so if you pay attention to the colors, you will know what chakra those crystals are activating. And also, as you speak and hold on to your crystals, whether silently or speaking, the crystal that you're holding is activating that chakra that it's supposed to acti activate. Now, it's up to you to meditate with that crystal and send that same vibration out into the universe that your chakras are trying to uh, connect with to be activated to its fullest potential. So, what you want to do, get out in nature, charge your crystal the way that uh, most are taught by the uh, energy which comes from the sun, energy that comes from the moon, the energy that comes from the rain, different elements within the earth. Use those elements to charge your crystals. 
ions once again is another way that you can charge your crystal smudging rainwater i'm pretty sure the sun gives off a certain type of ion too because the rain creates i'm gonna say the sun creates rain so i'm pretty sure the sun can actually uh, give off ions as well um uh, and many other things as plants trees so on and so forth so you want to be uh, aware of certain things that can actually charge you and your crystals now this just made me think about how trees give off a mist and um the oxygen that we need okay so i will have to find out and you should too if ions are inside of oxygen because if so that means that plants and trees are giving us the ions we need to survive and thrive and to live healthy um and that's what i meant earlier about uh, tapping into everything because uh, ions can actually uh, be helping you even though you're going down the wrong path. Ions are in nature, they're out here and uh, amongst the, the great nature of our planet. But the toxicity, the toxic stuff, it won't get the negative ions, it will get positive ions. And that's what you don't want because it's toxic. That means the ion has uh, attached to something that you really don't need because it's pure at, at its finest. Ions are pure itself, so it don't need a positive ion. It needs negative ions that just as pure as it can get. Okay. Um, this is Little LA Stay Live. I hope y'all learned something today. Uh, if not, you know, um, I'm going to come back with another big video to inspire you to be great. You know, uh, breathe greatly. Um, enjoy your crystals. You know, um, it's, this was about a crystal, uh, these crystals out here. So I hope you understood and listen to what i had to say about the crystals and hey i have so many crystals in this bucket i'm coming back with some more crystal videos once i get them all clean i want to make sure that you guys are able to see the video uh with them being clean and hey hope you enjoy the video make sure you hit the like button share and subscribe with your family and friends hey you watch to the end of this video you are definitely definitely activated you have definitely activated your heart chakra with these rose quartz crystals okay um stay tuned for more videos it's little la stay live i will be back peace